woman with a very impactful story of her own, Gigi Stetler, author of the new book, Unstoppable, Surviving is Just the Beginning. Gigi, thanks so much for joining us here on Newsmax Now. Thank you for having me. So when did you decide to write this book? Uh, well, I think after about maybe eight or ten crazy experiences, I had uh, so many people, when I would just tell the story like I was sitting in my living room telling a story. Which one? Was, you have several. <laughs> <laughs> that was, that was a, just one after another. Every time a, something would happen to me, people would say, you have to write a book. You have to write a book. you got to write a book because you just can't make that stuff up. It's, and, you know, I kind of, um, I, I was a little bit afraid to write the book uh, while my mother was still alive because I didn't want anyone to judge her, you know, because she's not going to get the Mother of the Year Award, but... If it wasn't for her, I probably wouldn't be the woman that I am today. So, you know, I, after, you know, many years and things, and I, I guess I finally, at the end of the day, decided to write it because, you know, I, I was tired of listening to people that just cry about small stuff and things. And if you read my book and you say that you, you know, you'll never say you had a bad day again. So, <laughs> so your book is kind of a compilation of some of your personal experiences, some of your trials and tribulations. Yes. Basically. And one person read it and they described you as being more of a warrior and not as a victim and they really love that. What do you hope others get from reading your book? That's exactly my story. No matter what happens to you, no matter what, treat, treat life, greet life as a warrior, not as a victim because the victim card doesn't work. Nobody cares. People don't really care. So, you know, take it and inspire and embrace everything that happens to you and move forward. Would you consider your story then to be one of a happy ending? Well, I'm still alive. And so still going happy. strong. I, I'm, I'm very much alive, and like I said, every day above ground is a great day for me. What do you attribute, though, to your spirit and bravery? I, I guess I, I just, you know, I had my eye on the goal of being a millionaire since I was 11, and also trying to uh, have my, my real father who passed away. I always wanted him to appreciate me, and he never did. And he ended up dying way before his time and before I actually got to know him. So I think my eye on the goal of being a millionaire, it never stopped. And I've had it, I've lost it, I've, I've been up and then knocked back down more times than you could possibly imagine, but I, I won't give up. I, it's just a, it's a passion. And do you have any plans to write another one? I'm halfway through my second book right now. <laughs> I had a feeling you might have more to tell. Gigi yeah. Settler, thanks so much for joining us. And where can we get the book, Unstoppable? To be unstoppable.com or amazon.com. Gigi, thank you so much for inspiring our viewers. Thank you. Have a great day. And good luck with the second book. Thank you. And more to come here. You're watching Newsmax now. Coming up, we're going to talk more about that brawl going on in Texas and some of the latest headlines, including how ISIS was able to take over the city, a city rather, in Iraq. That's coming up.